David, thanks for being with us today. Thanks, Steve. Great for having me. Let's start today with your giving us a brief overview of the company, how you started the company, and the technology itself. Yeah, SilverSafe is a publicly traded company located in Boulder, Colorado. And our mission is clear. We want to create safer environments, improve productivity, and more importantly, save lives. We'll be looking to acquire technology uh, as we move forward in the business. And we're looking exactly right now, talking to companies around THC, cocaine, opiates to expand our safety platform into the future. Our first product that we'll be launching in the second quarter of this year is around alcohol detection and prevention using biometrics and our patented technology. We're excited and we have four locations we'll be testing that platform and uh, the product going forward in the next uh, 60 days. Well, let's talk specifically about the technology and how it works. First and foremost, SoberSafe is a preventative technology and an overall platform. We're non-invasive, so there's no breath, there's no needles, just a touch of a finger. Importantly, we're creating a path in the preventative space. We're not in the mandatory space, so we're not, we won't be in roadside sobrieties. We're not about DUIs. We're not about blood alcohol. We're about preventing, so finding out whether or not there's alcohol in your system. So finally, we're tied to a very powerful database that enables the highest level of safety management and eventually leverage those analytics and that data to get up to insurance companies so we can leverage this product and this program to reduce liability costs. Well, let's talk about uh, the target market and how you're reaching those markets. As you're aware, our management team is highly focused around two specific market segments. The first segment is fleet management, specifically school bus. Our primary focus is around school buses because there's under a half a million buses transporting our children to and from school on a daily basis. There have been many confirmed cases of intoxicated drivers resulting in injuries and in some cases deaths of these children. We want to prevent accidents. We want to prevent these deaths and keep our children safe. So that's our primary target for us. The second target will be access management, specifically manufacturing and warehousing. David's estimated that alcohol use is as high as 17% in the manufacturing and warehouse space. That means tens of millions of impaired workers. The combined market revenue opportunity for SoberSafe is about eight and a half billion. But more importantly, the annual cost to insurers and business owners in these two market spaces is as high as $63 billion. Talk to us about the business model. How do you make money? What we're looking at is providing this service as a SaaS model where we will be charging users on a monthly basis and our patented technology will be used to gather data. Right now, we're looking at about a 74% gross margin and we'll have add-on products as well as we develop reports, things like that. So SaaS model, 74% gross margin, move the business forward from there. Who are some of the key players on your management team? And in particular, let's talk about your background. So a little bit on my background. Uh, I've got 33 years experience as an entrepreneur in leading technologies. I started with fiber optics when I was younger, went into SS7 packet signaling, high-speed imaging and robotics, name a few. I've been involved in the acquisition of 10 companies in my career. I've raised over $250 million in the public and the private markets. And uh, most recently, uh, been uh, lucky enough to bring on Kevin Moore as our president and CEO. By the way, we've been friends for many, many years, 30 plus years. Uh, so Kevin, his background, he's a 25 year entrepreneur with significant experience in manufacturing and testing, which is right up uh, our space right now, which is why we're starting in that space. His most recent exit was in 2017 in the heavy machinery space. Again, something that we'll be leveraging uh, to provide our technology in the future. And he brings more of a global experience because he was worldwide in his last two businesses. And his relationships will enable growth and success of Sober Safe as we move the business forward. By the way, between myself and Kevin, we've had six successful startups and exits in our career. 
So we're super excited, super poised about SilverSafe. And then finally, let's talk about the board of directors. We've got a great combination of successful business leaders uh, in the skill sets like engineering, finance, Wall Street, and, and more importantly, public company operation. So I think together with the board, myself and Kevin, we're excited about the talent and the capabilities we have going into this market space in Q2 of this year. David, what would you say is the essential value proposition for investors today? Well, Dave, I, I, we've talked about this before, but it's a VC-like entry point for investors and a public vehicle. So I think that's very critical. I mean, we, are, we have a product. We're going out in the second quarter. We've got interested parties. We're moving the business forward. And I think never in the history of we had in the last 10 or 15 years had a a point in time when everybody in business, insurance, and in general, in society and media is concerned about protecting lives and alcohol. So we've got a great market, tremendous amount of opportunity. And also, we're only talking about two market spaces, Dave. We're talking about workplace. We're talking about fleet. We've got a consumer product that we're working on. We're also going to be involved in with this with a detection platform, opiates, we're going to look at THC, we're really expanding the capability. So think of us as an integration platform for other types of detection. This is just the beginning. So I think the market, it's a tremendous opportunity and you're getting in at the ground floor as an investor. And you have uh, first to market uh, mover advantage. So it's an extraordinary product with a very large market opportunity. Agreed. David, thanks for being with us today. Thank you very much, David.